Say chess. We the best. What's up, it's Nigel. And I'm Zach. Right now, we're here with members of CHS. I'm Dusty, I'm a sophomore, and I'm a mentor. I'm Hannah, I'm a sophomore, and I'm a mentee. I'm Tyreek, I'm a sophomore, and I'm a mentee. I'm Dre, I'm a senior, and I'm a mentor. All right, so for all the people who have not heard of CHS, what, did, what does it stand for, and what is your organization about? Um, I'll take you. Um, well, CHS stands for Creating Higher Standards. Um, basically, what we are, we are a peer mentoring group. Basically, we have 74 students where we basically just kind of try to keep them on the right path. This transition from high school to college is a very big thing. I've seen many people actually fail at doing so. So we thought that this, was, this would be something that, that could be very beneficial for students like ourselves that just want to succeed. So that's basically what we just have here is people that want to succeed uh, like each other and help each other. That's good. What made you all join CHS? I joined CHS because I feel like it would better me and my education wise. I was I've been here since last fall semester and I'm continuing to be here and it's because I am changing my in my education. I currently have a 3.0 GPA and it's because I've been coming here and having my mentor by my side and keeping me saying it's very good. I'm I'm actually happy that I'm involved in CHS. So how many members are part of CHS? As I said earlier, I believe we have a total of 74 at IUP main campus, but we do have a plethora of members over at Punxsutawney as well. How do you motivate someone to do better in school and achieve their goals? Um, personally, from my standpoint as a mentor, what I do is I just try to understand them as a person and what helps them succeed in their academic career. And if they do need help, and get to know them on a personal level because it's not always just about academics. It's also to help them become a better person and grow. So you all give motivation to others. Who motivates you? Well, I can say for myself, my family base actually motivates me. Um, before me, my sister went to college, but she didn't finish. So I'll be the first to graduate college, and I'll be the first to actually graduate with honors. So I have a brother and sister. They are twins. They both actually just started college. One is at Punxsy, and my other, my sister, she's at Central Penn. So for me, it's kind of like I have these people looking at me to do well. So it's like if I fail, they do in a sense. So. My family base are the ones that motivate me. They, they motivate me because I want them to do well. Mm -hmm. uh, based off what he said, uh, my family motivate me, motivate me as well. Um, like I'm the first person to go to college and we'll be able to get a degree in, here at IUP. And I'm actually happy about that because I can able to help them and help my other generation as well. And who motivates me is my mom because she struggled, so I learned from her struggle. And when I'm here, I do have a good um, friend support system that helps me academically here as well. I say for me, um, of course, family motivates me, but also the students here because uh, yeah. college isn't always easy. You know, you sometimes want to quit and just say, forget it, you know what I mean, and go back home where things are a lot easier. But when you go to your class and you see all your other friends and your classmates still here, you know what I mean? That motivates me to obviously they don't if they keep doing it, so can I. And if they ain't quit, I'm not gonna quit either. Yeah, C chess really do help students. Like I can like I really can say for myself, but like, I really just stuck my gate up by just by being at CHS. Like people probably won't see it, but within me, I really do stuck my game up here by coming to the meetings and talking to people that are mentors and mentees as well. I agree. We actually all held each other accountable for everything that we do. For example, another one of the mentors, he has an average GPA of a 4.0. That's like, for me, that's kind of unheard of. So for me, I'm like, okay, well, that's something I may want to do. So last semester, for the first time, I've got a 4.0 just by seeing that that's something that he's been able to accomplish. So if he can do it, why can't I? So it kind of like motivates me in a sense, okay, do what they're doing. Be better. Be a better you in a sense. And it's also like a fun kind of uh, family competition type thing, you know what I mean? Because when I, when I first came in, I was kind of like just cruising through and my GPA wasn't all that. But and then, everybody, like like he was saying, uh, the boy he's talking about and him, they all bragging about their grades. You know, I'm doing this, I ain't in no class, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, oh, all right, so it's like that. I go into class, I make dean's list. I'm like, hey, Absolutely. you know what I mean? So, that's what you so for the people that are curious about CHS, is there a certain way they can join? Like, do they have to wait until the next semester or can they join right away? Well, actually, we generally have people coming and joining at the beginning of the semesters. Um, we do have ways that you can join. We have an actual website. We have like an app, kind of. So if you were to speak with any of the mentors, we could show you that. 
I don't have it right here on me, but I can definitely show it to you. Um, you can come and speak to anybody in CHS about it. So just speak with anybody that you know is in CHS or of that nature, we can definitely take it from there. And CHS don't take nothing. Like, if you come, don't come late to the meetings. Make sure you take it as serious, because we are serious about this, so. Yes, because we do put people out. That's why we went from 87 members last semester to 74 this semester. Yep. If you don't come and you're not setting a standard for yourself and others, we will show you the door. Because we're creating higher standards, you know what I mean? If you don't fall in that lane, why, why be here? Yeah. <laughs> in a sense. So for the last question, so people can keep up with CHS, do you guys have any social media pages? We actually do. We have... Uh, we have an Instagram page. If I'm not mistaken, we have a Twitter page as well. I don't believe we have a Snapchat or anything like that, but I do believe we have Instagram as well as Twitter. All right. Thank you, CHS, for allowing us to interview. Thank you, Hawk Talk fans. And wait, one more. Before we done, can y'all hit us with that little thing y'all got going on with CHS? Y'all want me to break it down? Yeah, you, 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 you let y'all do your thing. CHS, we the best. All right.